Good day, everyone. My name is Vashem Pushupa, and my work is a call for actions to eradicate the pest epidemia or PPR as the solution to improve the livelihood of smallholder farmers in developing countries. And we draw evidence from Senegal. Meet Fanta. She is a hardworking mother and a farmer, one of the 300 million smallholder farmers worldwide, mainly women, who depend on small remaining for food and income. The animals are the ATNs. Every year, the PPR virus, which has 90% mortality rate, is killing millions of sheep and goats and hampering the productivity of those that manage to survive. The virus is robbing smallholder farmers like Fanta of their basic right to good nutrition and livelihood, but it does not end there. In this study we conducted in Ethiopia and Burkina Faso, we saw that the impact of PPR goes beyond household like Fanta. The World Organization for Animal Health OIE estimate that the global damage due to PPR annually is up to 2 billion US dollars, turning back the clock on decades of development progress and outcomes. The good news is that PPR can be prevented with an effective and affordable vaccine that gives lifelong immunity to animals. Globally, the target to eradicate PPR is for 2030. In Senegal, that is 2025. Yet, PPR vaccine shortage is a critical issue in the Sahel and in Senegal. So to ensure that farmers like Fanta are part of the solution to this challenge, we run participatory disease modeling sections and we collected various data on herd size, vaccine availability, animal mobility, and we mapped it along key natural resources. This helped us to develop a special risk-based criteria to prioritize vaccinations. Later, we will assess the benefits cost ratio of these targeted vaccinations against the standard practice of blind mass vaccinations campaign. What we know from our research, however, is that globally, the benefits cost ratio of PPI eradications is 33.8 per dollar. We can therefore expect more significant return using a targeted approach combined with biosecurity measures, for instance. So investing in PPI vaccination is the viable solution to this global disaster. With our partners, we are then raising awareness and calling for actions to support PPS eradications in the Sahel and world world to ensure food and nutrition security poverty and conflict reductions, and to strengthen the resilience of these 100 million smallholder farmers, just like Fanta and her children, to give them a better life while also achieving the sustainable development goals. With that, I thank you for your attentions.